our campsite for tonight. It's an oldie but goodie. Bill's up here. I was just coming back from our bear line hang. So, here's to night number one. spot we were at is the right one for the, for the spring. Hi. <laughs> hey, hey. Night one. Heading towards nightfall. It is. Good morning. Tuesday morning. I'm inside the tent. Morning in the tent. Good stuff. <laughs> Good morning. Day two after we had breakfast and we're about to leave. But um, I found something last night I thought maybe everybody would like to see. It's pretty cool. So here we go. When you look on top, you have green canopy. Green canopy. Beautiful green canopy. So when you go underneath, you have beautiful purple flowers. And there's another one. And another one. They're everywhere. And another one. Aren't they awesome? It's like a belly of... It's like a belly of purple flowers. It's awesome. <laughs> have a great day. And that would be the elusive bill. If you ever want to see him, go to a tennis court or a mountaintop. <laughs> Top of the root. Family tree. Bill and the Green Arches. <laughs> A man on his path. Can't stand in his way. Just another beautiful day on the trail. Tough morning climb up Avery Gap Trail. But Trees are blooming. So we came upon this <clears throat> we came upon this guy on the trail and I got excited for a second. I'm like, oh maybe it's trail magic. I would love a little mini Dr. Pepper. However, it's definitely locked. I thought it was a bear box or something, but um, there's some combinations. Property of USA, for service. I'm guessing they put tools in it. It's pretty cool. Got some stickers. This is a big bike trail as well. I'm not with it all the time, but we do share it on occasion. So, ta-da! Were you looking for trail magic, baby? <laughs> I was. I got my own. <laughs> red faced. Imagine that. I'm always red faced on the trail. And there's my sweat box. That should be our trail name red face and sweat box. Just thinking. Bill calls it the Fern Forest. It's just a little peekaboo on our trail. Hey. Look what we saw on the trail. I must pee myself. That is a rattler. I'm getting away. It looks like a cyclops. 
Or Star Wars. I'm just the opposite. If I can figure out how to have the waist belt, I'm not used to shoulders. It's weird that it's springtime on the Blue Ridge and we have fall ish foliage. Kind of crazy. Can we mention that the taxes are like this? Day three. Good morning. This is where we slept. Day three. Morning three of our adventure. Morning two. Morning two, actually, yeah. It's day three. We have one more night. So, how'd you sleep last night? Fits and starts. We chose to, well, because it was quick, we changed locations from our prior one, so we drove up further up the mountain. So I think we were at 5,000 feet, About 5, feet yeah. before we hiked in, but fortunately this is like just off the road. Um, there's a creek next to us, which is awesome for getting quick water, but it's cold. Condensation. <laughs> Condensation. <laughs> so things got a bit wet and um, they were already feeling damp from the night before by the waterfall. But um, we're learning. We call it shakedown for a reason, right? So today we're going to keep it easy again, do nine miles um, and come back not up. Not much elevation today. There's not a lot of elevation gain. It's more distance. There is some elevation gain. That's what this is all about, to get our backs ready for the for the whites, but, um, it's going to be a beautiful day. Right, sweetie? I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> he's, but he's not looking at the camera. <laughs> Bye. Here comes the sun, little darling. Here comes the sun, and I'll say it's all right. Do, 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 do. It's going to be a beautiful day. Good morning. I don't know if you can see it. The way this comes through. Morning mist. Morning mist. And sunshine. My husband getting ready for a day on the trail. So we're running late, time to boogie. See you on the upside. Bye. Good morning. Morning. What are we doing? We're making up a loop. The Flat Laurel Creek Trail to Sam Knob Trail. Walking up Black Balsam Road. And then taking the mountains to Sea Trail back. So we're making a loop that comes back to our car. Around nine miles. He says loop, I say patchwork quilt. <laughs> Should be fun. Good walk. Bye. Beautiful day. The start of the Flat Laurel Creek Trail. So, across the stream and off we go. Whichever one you want to do. Nice little surprise. Yeah, Morning nice. falls. And if it was warmer out, you could go for a swim. Sheila exploring the falls. It's awesome, she says. <laughs> And it comes across here. A 
and down. Beautiful. It's been a long time since I've read about this thing. I actually have marked in my coming out wilderness. We have a bee doing this pollination on the trail. Do your thing, baby, do your thing. When your heart's in the woods, here and there. My heart is coming to my heart. Oh. Just below Little Sam Mob. Great falls. We're on top of the falls. Beautiful. Along the trail. Lots and lots of waterfalls. This is so awesome. It's one happy man. On the connector. Heading up that way to Sam. Up we go. Look at those clouds are coming in. But this is beautiful. We just came up Laurel, Flat Laurel Creek, Creek and now we're heading up Sam's Knob. Let's do it. Into the enchanted forest. <laughs> and up we go. Sweet for a lunch spot.